If you're looking for a pretty powerful day trading strategy that can get you in and out of the market in about 30 to 60 minutes, you may want to consider the gap and go strategy. And this strategy involves identifying gaps in the market during the opening bell and then taking advantage of the momentum that they create. When you have pre-configured scans and you know scanners like Finviz, you can easily spot these opportunities and monitor multiple stocks at once. Now, timing is really important with this strategy. You gotta be early. You gotta really monitor the price movements after the market opens. So what is it? As I mentioned, 30 to 60 minutes, you could be out of the market. So to implement the strategy, you got to identify these gaps. So you can use a pre-market screening tools and pay attention to high volume gaps that indicate continuation in the gap direction. You can combine this strategy with indicators like level two data if you want, time and sales for further insights. Most people don't, just pure price action. So remember though, there's risks and there's rewards involved. Volatility and spreads can be challenging depending on what stock you're trading, but the high profit potential and the long short trade opportunities makes it a worthwhile strategy. So how do we do it? We got to look at pre-market movers and we got to use screens or websites to find stocks that have significant gaps. Very easy to find. Look at the daily chart, understand the prior price action and identify consolidation patterns. Usually you want to use about a five minute chart entry criteria. So you would wait for a pullback or just a brief consolidation after that initial gap. So this is going to provide a potential entry point with a more favorable risk to reward ratio. And you can absolutely use indicators like moving averages, make sure they're short term. You can use trend lines, you can use candlestick patterns. So to identify an entry signal, for example, a bullish candlestick pattern or a break above a short term resistance level that could trigger your entry. You want to monitor price action, adjust your stop loss and your target levels based on any further movement. And of course, you want to exit the trade once your target gain is reached or if the price action suggests a reversal. So set your profit targets based on key levels like resistance zones, pivot points, previous highs. You can use trailing stops if you want to capture additional gains and then look for final momentum thrusts as well. But remember, this type of strategy requires quick decisions and you got to focus during that first 30 to 60 minutes of the trading session. But it's a simple strategy and with careful implementation, careful practice, this strategy can potentially bring in significant profits in a short amount of time. Anyways, rewatch this video. If you have any questions, pop them below. I always answer them. Hit like, hit subscribe. We'll talk to you soon.